Let me get this out of the way right now. This isn't real, none of this happened. The events talked about here are fictional, fake, untrue, except for the ones that aren't, which may possibly be all of them. So yeah, to recap, this isn't real, except for all the parts that are. Got it, because I don't want to hear about this later. Anyways, welcome to the Aurora Wasteland. Cue the Jurassic Park theme, the Twilight Zone door, the X-Files badge, the Lost Fade, or whatever gets you in the fucking mood for the strange. Shit, can I say fuck on here? Oh well. If you're squeamish, this isn't for you. What I'm about to tell you will nudge you from your comfort zone. It will open your eyes to the things you'd wish you'd kept them closed for. Like knowing that your parents fuck, because they do and a lot. Moving on, what is the Aurora Wasteland? Simple, it's an area that lives beyond man-made borders, a place where the strange and weird thrive. A place made up of places you hoped didn't exist. Hmm, I probably shouldn't have used the word place there twice. Frick, you're a writer, man. You're supposed to be better than this. Get your shit together. Whatever. A place made up of people you wouldn't want to meet. People you wouldn't want to be. Because escaping from the nightmare that is the Aurora Wasteland, well, that's just not possible. That's pretty fucking heavy. I like it. Okay, listen, I'm going to tell you a story, and it's going to cross media, mostly YouTube podcasts and my novels. The novels are where the heart of the story is going to live, but the strange and the details live everywhere else, between the lines, between the stories. This is going to take a while. Shit, that's kind of a vague timeline. Ah, uh, whatever. But it's going to make sense at the end, I promise. I'm going to need you to trust me. Aspects of what I'm about to tell you may not seem related. They may seem like monsters of the week from time to time, but they aren't, except for the ones that aren't. So pay attention, I'm only going to tell you this once. I don't want to repeat myself, and I don't want to hear your bitching later. I should probably point out that I'm a writer. My name is Vaughn Ashby. Cue the intro.